Some people don't need your friendship. They need your refreshment. Be careful of people looking for refreshment from you and not friendship. They saw the woman with the alabaster box. They were talking about the money. Judas was quick to talk. After that, that when you read verse 10, 11, he stood up to betray Jesus. She, he was concerned about the money, not the friendship. Jesus knew there was a relationship between him and that woman. And that friendship was, she honors my burial. Some people are looking for refreshment and not friendship. When they greet you four times, they are greeting your pocket and not you. When they bow down to you, they are servicing their belly. They are not honoring you. Some sheep are burdens. Why some are refresh are investment? Some of you are trying to make friends out of fans. Your fans are not your friends. Your fans love you for what you do. Your friends love you for who you are. You are not getting me. The people are clamping hard for you. It's not because they love you. They love what you do. If you ever allow yourself to be carried away by fans, they will blow you away. Fans. Wow. She acted the movie very good. Fans. Wow, he scored the ball. Football fans. Comedian fans. Some prophets don't have friends. They have prophetic fans. They're clamping out. Wow, powerful prophecy. They are not interested in you. What you see on social media as are fans. They are not friends. They love you for what you do. They don't love you for who you are. Friends are not after what you do. They love you for who you are. Until you get to a level to understand that the same people that clamp on for you yesterday can destroy you tomorrow. Some leaders politically don't have friends. They have political fans. Oh, that one is going to be a good president, a good governor. After one year, the same people that wrote mighty things about the politician and say we want you out. Be careful of people who love you for what you do and not who you are. That's why most great leaders die lonely because people don't want them to be who they are. So that's why we have too many artificial leaders packaging themselves and not trying to be real. Some of, sometimes most of us just want a man of God not to be himself. That's why we have too many hypocrites everywhere. Packaging themselves, not being themselves. Because we are happy at what they do. We don't we are not happy of who they are. That's why a man of God now decides to be himself on other areas of his personal life. Yeah. You call yourself a man of God and you are doing this kind of thing. It looks so odd that the man of God is watching a football to some people. Because they feel that you should always be in the spirit, playing spiritual ball. There are too many dangerous people you call friends. They are your fans. And it is very easy to get fans. Say something unique that will make them to be happy. They clamp on for you. They give you a lot of likes and thumbs up. But they will never pay any bill or carry any burden for you. Sometimes our church can be they are not filled with members, they are filled with fans. Fans who come around for a shop, not for a God that they want a relationship with. Fans. Fans. Today, hey, the praise 
worship did not, the leader did not dance well. But what they came for is just to dance. Eles já apenas vieram para fans. Eles vieram como fãs. Fãs, they see life as a game. Os fãs veem a vida como um jogo. They don't take serious. Não levam tudo They can wear the jersey of the footballer and if the footballer miss the goal for penalty, they will burn him down. If they have a way to kill him, they will kill him. Because they bet with the football. Fans. Every smile and ovation is not a mark of acceptance. It's a spontaneous behavior for what is happening now. Friends, we stay with you through thick and thin in life. They are not here because people are clamping hard. They knew you and who you are and your pain. They stay around you for who you are. So many imperfect members are looking for perfect pastor. 